Hi, my name is Richard, and in this video I'll be showing you how to install your Sneedjet Infinity onto one of the print stands. So you'll see here um, in the video, or right here in this frame, I have a print stand already set up with the legs and the bars on it. So you'll see we have three legs in the tripod and the bar here going up. Now your print stand is also going to come with two other bars and two compression clamps. So in the box, you should have this bar. You'll see here, and then this, and this bar here is special. It has a little um, telescoping antenna arm, or not telescoping, I'm sorry, but just bendable. Great. Now the first thing you're going to want to do is take one of these compression clamps, as you see here, pretty basic, straightforward. See one hole smaller than the other, and we'll insert this photo eye bar and clamp it down nice and tight. Now we're going to go ahead and slide it over the top of this. Slide it down. Let's go ahead and turn this so we can see what's going on. Now in here, if you watch our video on installing the photo eye, this will probably look a little familiar to you. It's for mounting that photo eye. So go ahead. You'll take those two steel nuts that came in the package with your photo eye, and you'll do the same thing as we did before the video. There's two of these steel nuts that come with it. So we're going to go ahead and put one down onto the photo eye to begin with for a stopper here, and we'll just slide it right into this bar here. Let's see if we can move this closer for you. Great. So you see, um, oops, so we got it right in there. Let's go ahead and stick it in here and tighten this guy down. Great. Now make sure you'll see here, this um, piece here needs to be tightened. So right now I'm very loose. I'm just going to go ahead and tighten it while I've already still have the photo eye on it. And I hand tightened it, but you're going to want to grab some pliers or something like that to make sure it's nice and tight. But you'll see here, now I have my photo eye mounted. And this is movable wherever I need it, um, you know, just to make things easier for you. So let's put that off to the side for now. And then let's go ahead and grab our second compression clamp and the other bar. Same thing as before. We've got that nut clamp down good and hard. Go ahead and do that. So just as before, you'll see we have this motion here in the clamp. And we're just going to go ahead and slide this right onto there. We'll go ahead and just barely tighten these up. Don't tighten each screw all the way until you get them all started at least. Great. Now we can go ahead and tighten these all the way down. Now our printer is connected to the stand. So from this point, it's basic plug and play. We're just going to plug our photo sensor in. We're going to go ahead and plug our power in. And the printer is essentially ready to go. So you can see here, I still have access to my fine tuning module. We can go ahead and turn that, move the device wherever we want. Um, it's very simple. It couldn't be easier. Thanks for watching.